Now there are aircraft of all different shapes and sizes here at Le Bourget, but this one for me is the best looking at the moment. It's the H160 helicopter from Airbus and it is absolutely brand new. So much so that it only flew for the first time last week. So what's special about it? Well, it's entirely made of carbon composites. That high-tech plastic really. It means it's very light. So like the Airbus A350, for example, or the Boeing 787, it uses less fuel than conventional aircraft. Some other details as well. Look up. See those rotor blades? They're kinked like hockey sticks. That means it's less noisy than other helicopters, which is good if you're flying in urban areas. Over here in the cockpit, very complicated, but apparently those avionics are state of the art. Now, if we walk further down the aircraft, it really is full of new designs. Apparently, there's a whole list of patents associated with it. Airbus has invested a lot of money, so it's taking a bit of a risk. You can't see all of them, but if you come down here, this tail rotor, a lot of thought has gone into this. These blades are offset. That means it should be quieter. Again, good for urban areas, and the whole thing is tilted, so that generates more lift. It should improve performance. Now, this aircraft has been developed for a whole range of uses. For example, flying people out to oil rigs or police forces using them in cities. So it is an important aircraft for the company. They need it to be a success. It's only just started flying. There may be teething troubles ahead. But one thing they have done is let the stylists loose on it, which is why it looks the way it does. And personally, I think those stylists have done a very good job indeed.